Space phobia is a severe and irrational fear of stars and space. Depending on the person, it can be linked to other phobias such as alienophobia and nyctophobia, which is the fear of aliens and the fear of the dark. Usually, when people look at photos involving planets and space, they feel fascinated or sometimes excited. I feel fear. When I look at photos of Saturn, Jupiter, Neptune, I felt an overwhelming sense of dread coming from the photo, fearing me to the point where I had to avoid my own computer screen. For me, space is unsettling and terrifying. Pictures that you find to be beautiful or cool are what I find to be intimidating or disturbing. But I also think that space is fascinating. Galaxies and universes are exciting to me and I'm pretty sure they will be exciting for everyone else as well. I love space, yet I fear it. When I was a child, I was going through my encyclopedia book that my family had recently bought for me. It was all going well until the topic of space came up. When I saw the sun on the page, I, I felt an extreme feeling of dread to the point that I had to cover the book with my eyes. That fear would soon grow when I was shown a video called The Sons of Planets, a video showcasing every planet's sons while putting photos to show which one it is. This scared the fuck out of me. The photos that were being shown didn't have either. Photos of planets give off a feeling that is strangely mysterious and threatening. When I look at photos of astronauts on the moon, I get a sense of loneliness because okay okay to be honest I don't think anyone will look at this photo and go wow this is so cheerful like that one scene from Breaking Bad to give a more detailed explanation of how I feel when I look at pictures of planets or anything involving space the best example of a feeling that is sort of similar to space phobia will be liminal spaces liminal spaces consist of the interior or, or any kind of structure that is big and empty that carries an eerie and pretty unsettling vibe from it this feeling is also present when you play on an empty map in a source game like Gary Smart, where an area is seen as familiar yet so hostile with the emptiness because you're used to having people or at least something going on. It is a similar feeling to when I or any person with space phobia looks at a photo of space. For me, it can be a bit more specific if I look at photos of galaxies that have been edited to look colorful or fantasy-like as you see here, I won't feel that overwhelming sense of dread. If I look at the real one, I will feel it. However, if I look at photos of the newly released NASA photos of Jupiter or the Sun, that feeling does not resonate with me as much. This makes me think that a part of the space phobia that is triggered by just viewing pictures of planets is because of the limitations of NASA's camera to capture these photos. Because of how limited it is, it does not show the true details and make it look more eerie in a way because of how limited it is. It's kind of like how some people find old photos a bit unsettling because of the lack of color, tone imbalances, and edge condition of the photo. In fact, this does not only apply to old photos, there's a reason why there are horror games using the PS2 aesthetic or using low poly models. There is something uncanny when you see a monster in low polygon graphics with a janky animation and that plays well into horror. For example, Cry of Fear. The horror aspect of that game was incredible and most of it was due to the limitations of the Gold Source engine. All games in general just feel isolated, lonely and claustrophobic. Even games like Super Mario 64 creep me out. Limitation brings a sense of uncanny valley and that is kind of a part that plays into space phobia. Just like how I feel with the visuals of old games, space makes me feel lonely and claustrophobic. Chuckle over that one. I'm coming after you.